Hi everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy a really positive week. So Virgo, here are your cards for this week starting the 5th of December. And from the Teacup Tarot deck, your overall energy here is the Seven of Wands. And this card says, be gently and kindly assertive and keep moving forward towards success. And just like the angel on the card, look, she's nearly there. She's almost got to the finishing line, but there's a gate across with some grumpy sheep behind it. And she needs to get past those to keep moving forward. So she's going to have to just be assertive in a gentle and kind way and all will be well. The seven of teacups got two sevens. This is your help or your hurdle card. And this says, just look at all your choices carefully. This card says, stand back, look at all your options, think things through before you decide. And that's just what she's doing here. Look, she's got the choice of seven teacups. And some have lovely things in like bars of chocolate or stars. But there's a little grumpy gingerbread man here. She doesn't want to choose him. So she's wisely taking her time, thinking it all through, looking at all her options. The guidance here, the eight of teacups says, take it one step at a time. Here's the success. It's here on both of these cards. Look, she's moving towards it. But she's just poised at the edge here on this card. And the Eight of Teacup says, just take that first step and the next will be right in front and so on, right the way across. So this week, don't try to do it in one giant leap. Know that individual small steps will get you to success just as easily. But take it step by step. How can we help ourselves? We've got the card 11, the strength card. Again, this is about assertiveness, just standing up for yourself, using kindness to get your point across this week will get you far further, so much more quickly. Pulling it all together, the nine of coins says it's time for you to enjoy the results of your hard work. Take some time out for a little treat. Time for you to rest. Time for you to relax and enjoy some time. It's truly earned. You've put in the hard work. Now it's the time for you to really enjoy it. And the final outcome card, the, the five of wands says, if there's anybody else having a drama or if there's any nonsense going on in the background, don't take any notice of it. Keep walking towards the sunshine. Don't get involved in anybody else's drama. Just leave it where it is and walk right past. So just to summarise the teacup tarot cards, be gently and kindly assertive this week. Think your choices through with care. Don't get involved in anybody else's drama. Take it a step at a time. It's The road to success is clear for you. Just take it easy, step by step, and take time out just to enjoy some little treats just for you. So let's just clarify with the Time to Shine deck. The two of emotion is about good relationships, positive outcomes to discussions, quality time with other people. It also reminds you that in your discussions with other people, in your conversations with other people, to make sure that you clearly understand one another. So clear communication is key this week. The seven of thoughts says it's time to follow your plans now. Focus on your needs. This is about learning from the past, 
closing your door on the past and moving forward with optimism. So lovely that it's fallen again alongside the eight of teacups. The 20 of wisdom says it's time for you to realise how far you've come, realise how well you're doing and start to plan the next adventure. Reflect on how far you've come and now, where do you want to go next? The seven of wisdom brings a movement forward. This brings an action plan. This brings with it um, a lovely movement. If things have felt a bit stuck, if you've not been sure here quite what to do, when you take it step by step, this is the movement forward. And the seven of wisdom says, do it with discipline. And do it with balance. No quick decisions, no impulsive decisions. Think it all through. Get your plan. And here's your move forward when you've got it. The seven of action. Double message, same card, different deck. Standing up for yourself, being gently and kindly assertive. And also thinking choices through with care. Again, it's just emphasising this Seven of Teacups card again. And the final outcome card here is the Ten of Thought. This is about moving on, moving on up. This is about the situation improving and you starting to enjoy the situation. Moving on, being happy and you climbing that staircase of success. So very much a week where being gently and kindly assertive is key, making wise and sensible choices is key. But once you get that clarity, when your discussions with other people, the move forward is here, expect things to get better, expect things to improve. And here's you step by step to success. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button. It really makes a difference to me when you do. Thank you for doing that. And then you'll get notified when I do the next readings for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.